to Hamilton's waterfront now where construction on a Titanic era ship has begun. The SS Keewatin is more than 100 years old. Sean Cowan is at Heddle Shipyards with more. And Sean, this is a very unique project for Heddle, right? That's right, Taz. If you take a look behind me here, that's a Canadian Coast Guard ship. And those are the types of boats that Heddle usually works on. But if you take a look right over here, that's the Keewatin. So this is a special project for them. The Keewatin was built in Scotland back in 1907, and now it's the only Titanic-era ship left in the world. So it's time for a little facelift, and while in Hamilton, the ship's deck will be restored. So right now we're starting to take up some of the old deck boards, uh, and then we'll be going through, plugging all the holes, uh, and then painting the deck so that it's ready for the new decking whenever that takes place. For Heddle Shipyards, getting to work on a vintage ship is a treat. It's not a big project, but it's a different and it's a unique project. Uh, just given the age of the vessel and the type of work that we're doing here versus what we would do on a day-to-day -day basis. So it's not in relation to some of the work that we do over a big project, but it's a neat one. While Heddle is mainly working on the outside of the ship, there are some very cool spaces inside this historic vessel. So this is the, the engine room of the Keewatin. Uh, again, this is one of the last steam engines uh, in existence uh, of this era. And so behind us is the boiler room. So the boiler would have created steam, which would have been fed to the pistons, which would have driven all these rods and this whole shaft would have been uh, turning. Uh, and this water would have provided the, the main propulsion of the ship. The Keewatin once carried cargo and passengers around the Great Lakes up until the 1960s. The Keewatin made its way to Hamilton from a museum in northern Michigan. But when this restoration project is complete, it will be shipped to the Marine Museum of the Great Lakes in Kingston. And I think people will really enjoy it when they come in and it's, it's all uh, dressed up and staged properly. Uh, we're building a mu uh, museum e exhibit for it in the next year. So people will have some orientation uh, before they even board the ship and take a tour. The Keewatin will be here at Heddle Shipyards in Hamilton until September. So the big question is, will you be able to get on the Key One while it is here in Hamilton? Unfortunately, the answer is no. This is a construction zone. You will have to wait until next spring and summer and then make your way to Kingston.